Hey everybody, Polius here. Let's play some more Sentinels of the Multiverse. I think I did. Let me read. Yeah, that's that's what the game says it is. Uh, getting back into the groove of it now that I don't need to be on that ice machine constantly. Um, and if you listen, also fix that background noise thing. Which means I can up the sound of the game. Uh, options, music line. Yeah, 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 yeah. Excellent. Uh, this is such a great game. We actually uh, had a D and D session get canceled before everyone went on quarantine, and well, it's because not enough people showed up, but there were enough people to play Sentinels. So I pulled out. Well, I had people pull out for me because I still can't lift more than thirty pounds. Um, my uh, physical copy, and we played it. Do I want to fight apostate? He's kind of. He's kind of. Chump. I said he's a chump! Get out of here, you chump! I feel like this is a team we've seen before. I do feel like a team has been done like this. You know who I haven't fought in a long time? Cosmic Omnitron. Let's suffer. Let's just suffer. I mean, if I really wanted to be in bad shape, I'd... Oh, uh, I could make this a, a terrible, terrible fight for me. I'm not gonna. Power source unknown. Directive destroyed. We got ourselves a little learning opportunity here. Welcome to the school of hard knocks. Omnitron, of course, starts... This version of Omnitron starts off with three components revealed. And then, uh, if there are no components, he flips. So we've got the disintegration ray, the interpolation beam, and the interpolation beam. And then he disintegrates us for all of the damage, then destroys all of our equipments, and then plays the adaptive plating subroutine. Okay, a lot of stuff happened there. Of course, the disintegration ray, at the start of his turn, he deals 600 damage, the hero with the highest HP. Uh, for As with all components, if he's dealt 7 or more damage in one round, it's destroyed. Uh, interpolation beam, every time a hero draws a card, that player, Omnitron deals that hero 1 energy damage. And then the adaptive plating subroutine is he becomes immune to the most recent damage he has received. Yeah. Alright. What do we have here? Mono. A mono. So that play this card next to a non-hero target. When that target leaves play, destroy this card. And if your turn, mainstay deals that target 2 melee damage. That target deals mainstay 2 melee damage. This card's destroyed. Mainstay regains 2 HP. Problem. Mainstay deals a lot of melee damage. Alright, what do we got here? Each non-hero target deals mainstay one melee damage, mainstay deals each non-hero three. I'm a-thinking we're gonna play a sweet Ronda here. Reduce damage dealt to mainstay by non-target environment cards by one, and at the end of your turn, uh, either draw a card or destroy one of your ongoings. Well, so look, it's gonna take a bunch of damage here, but... Yeah. Do I want to draw a card? Yes. There we go, Void Belter. I think Void Belter is exactly what we need. Nope, that just uh, does melee damage. Okay, but we've dealt him one damage so far. Enclave's Tech. Reveal cards from the top of your deck until an equipment card, excuse me, is revealed, put it into play, discard the others. We've got the Orphic Repository at the end of your turn. Either put the top card of your trash under this card or remove all cards under this card to your hand. Um, deals himself three psychic damage. Okay, we're gonna, just gonna Enclave Tech. Maybe get, um, oh! At the end of your turn, Lifeline either regains one HP or deals one target one lightning damage. So this reduces the damage that he would take, eh? 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 Alright. Ha ha ha! Yes! Draw those cards, Lifeline! Show them what it means to have one point of damage reduction. There we go. Uh, Wraith, you are not set up to really do much of anything. But we can set up for later. And let's take a look. At the environment turn, that steals a non-environment target with the second highest HP for melee damage. I don't like it. You want to draw a card? Yes. We actually need cards. Meh. <sighs> How much has he taken? Two. 
I don't think we're gonna do it this turn, gents and ladies. So I'm gonna set up for next turn. Yes, I want you to draw a card. That is useful. Thank you. Alright, Healing Pollen. When this card is uh, played, the environment target. One target regains 4 HP. When this card is destroyed, draw a card. And each hero regains 1 HP. When this card is played from the environment deck, you may discard a number of cards. When this card is destroyed, blah blah blah. First time environment card enters play each turn. Other player, discard the top card of the environment deck. At the end of your turn, you may shuffle a Primordial Seed from the environment trash into the environment deck. Deals herself up to 4 damage. Draw X cards and discard X cards. Um... X the amount of damage she has dealt herself this turn. We are going to go ahead and just punch herself in the face. Oh, no. Okay, so uh, I didn't think that through. But we are going to put four of these. No seed from your hand or trash into the environment deck. Draw a card. Uh, and then take them all. I'm going to skip her power and just draw a card. Oh, hey, there we go. Challenge of Fire. The environment turn, deal each target two fire damage. So the environment turn, each player may discard up to three cards. If seven cards are discarded this way, destroy this card. Well, that's unfortunate. Another disintegration, right, huh? <laughs> Electromagnetic super gun. Well, I mean... I'm not happy about it. So we're going to go ahead and play the Void Belter. And we're going to belt him in the face with the Void. Do not destroy. Well, no, do not destroy. Yes, they draw a card. Headlock is useful. Um, in, because he's holding an infernal detonator. Um, at the end of your turn, put up to five cards from your hand under this card when this card is destroyed. Alright, so that takes some time to set up. Uh, destroy one environment card, that card with a target, lifeline deals up to three targets, one infernal damage each. Well... Oh wait, here we go. I can play two. So we're gonna do this. Play two. See what we get with the Enclave tech. Oh, we got the Super Axe. And it deals infernal damage. So I'm also going to play this. And I'm just going to destroy the Challenge of Fire, I think. Yeah, I don't want to draw cards. I don't. I don't care. Uh, deal one lightning damage, though. Uh, got to load up that damage. Uh, you know, just to be safe, I'm going to play this. What do we got? Oh, uh, trash that. Yeah, I'm gonna draw some cards. Throat jab would have been nice! Alright. Do I want to draw a card? Yes. Uh. Um... I need something to do with my draws. Alright. Whenever he's dealt fire damage, deals that much, uh, deals one target that much cold damage. Well, shoot. Skip. Yes. He is not getting what he needs. I do not think that we are going to do very well here. He has been dealt five damage. We are short just two damage. Can I do it? One target, three projectile damage. All right, whenever not here, uh, when this card, ah ha ha. All right. Kablooey. All right, we still have to deal with the, the plating, but. Spike trap. The end of the environment turn, one player may destroy one of their equipment cards to destroy this card. At the end of the environment turn, deal the target with the lowest HP, three melee damage. Does anyone have a card that I want destroyed? 
What is the lowest HP at? Absolute zero. So he's only going to take two. Um, skip. So now he's just going to play a whole bunch of mess. Oh, the electric pulse explosive. Please don't. Oh, and he shoots us all a whole lot. How much does he shoot for? Uh, three hero targets with the highest HP, four damage each. Okay. Not great. Draw a card, destroy an ongoing or equipment card. If you destroy one of your cards this way, you may play a card. Um, that's going to deal one, uh, two projectiles. He's currently immune to projectile damage. Um, reduce damage, destroy deals one target, three projectile damage. We gotta get rid of that pulse explosive. So I'm gonna put this here. And I'm gonna void belter it. And then I'm gonna destroy the headlock. Just to get some extra damage in. Alright. Alien Akana. First time uh, an ongoing card other than uh, this one enters lifelines play area. Draw a card. At the end of your turn, deals one target, one infernal damage. It's not great. I think I'm gonna. What's this? Uh, from five cards from hand. Mm. Also not great. We're gonna go ahead and put this out. But um, we need to hit this. Uh, deal one target, one lightning damage, and one infernal damage. All right. Throat jab. Bonkify Omnitron. Uh, trash that. Very nice. Hey, hey, we need that. So, everyone for that. Uh, in this case, we are going to focus apertures, and we're just going to kill off the pulse cannon. Just be done with it. Ooh, core fire. Uh, cultivation at the end of your turn. Discard to play the top card of the environment deck. Think we're gonna do that whenever a villain card will be played deal yourself two psychic damage takes damage this way play the top card of the environment deck instead so if your turn destroy this card ah. shuffle the environment trash into the environment deck discard six cards from the top of the environment deck uh deals herself one target uh x toxic damage well, akash really can't take too much more um enter play um other player or discard the top card of the environment deck all right, I think we're just gonna cultivation. What's in the environment trash? Oh yeah, shuffle one card or all cards from the environment trash into the environment deck, or play the top card of the environment deck. Well, we're gonna shuffle all cards and then discard the top. Strangling roots. Uh, discard the top. Hey! Anubis. So who's going to take that hit? Second highest HP, Akash Threa. Lowest HP is the Repair Drone. We don't have to worry about that, so skip. Oh, that's real bad. Well... That could be worse. We didn't take a whole bunch of damage. So I'm I'm willing to accept the situation. Hmm. Place next to a non-hero target. When the target leaves play. Um, destroy this card at the end of the environment turn. Main state deals that target two damage and all right. So we are going to headlock Omnitron. I'm going to Void Belter him. And I'm going to destroy my headlock. And hit him with a projectile. Well, what happens? Well, what's going on? First time a non-environment card is destroyed each turn. This card deals the environment target with the second highest HP. Oh. You need to go. Alright. Leyline Shift. 
No damage. Discard the top card of everything. What are we putting into play? Um, I mean, calculated action, either play two cards or draw three. I kind of need to draw cards. Mono and mono is pretty nice. I think I'm gonna do calculated action. Just draw three. Um Yeah, we're gonna hit this. Oh no. Uh, deal one target, one lightning damage. Throwing knives. Alright, well, let's hit a whole bunch of stuff with throwing knives. Stop doing damage. Razor Ordnance. Alright, um. Oh my god, I need to play this before I do anything else. But I can still hit for three. Coolant Blast is a good one. Alright. Uh, first time environment enters play, other players or discard. Yeah, let's do it. So remove a seed from your hand. Doesn't have any in her trash, right? She has one. We're going to do Strangling Roots, though. Move it from your hand. Ooh, Vitalized Thorns. Real good. We're going to try environment trash into the environment deck. Perfect. And hey, look at that! <laughs> Anubis, this is my spike trap. Healing pollen. Who needs the heal? Um, actually, Wraith does. Skip. It's not a problem. Oh, come on. We're going to take... Uh, 11 damage there. Each non-hero target, 3 damage. Alright, yeah, I'll take 3 damage to do... All that. Um, can't hit Omnitron, so I might as well hit the Explosive. Skip to draw an extra card. Lonesome Highway. That's actually really good, isn't it? One non-hero, two melee damage. Uh, if main stays a hero character card, the lowest HP deals one target four. Okay. All right, we got options. First time you would draw a card, you use a power instead. Repair ley line. Hmm. Pretty good. Harrow. Three other targets, infernal damage. I think we're gonna matter manipulate manipulator. Yes, I want to use power now. Go ahead and hit this. And someone else has got a thing to do, so we're just gonna keep doing this. Then deal one lightning damage. Utility belt, because then I can manipulate the deck. Ooh. Yeah, put that in play. Put it in play. Excellent. Uh, play the top card of the environment deck. Strangling Roots. Alright, so what? Um... Oh, nice. Select three targets, reduce the damage by two. So, Omnitron... Until the start of your turn. Okay, well that's less nice. But hey, it's more targets to absorb damage on. Hit Omnitron. Hit Anubis. And we'll hit the Pulse. I think it's time for a Horrifier. For the Cold, we'll hit Omnitron. For the Fire, we'll hit... The pulse thing we doable. 
heal himself, and deal some cold to Anubis. And then hit Anubis again. That felt pretty good. Okay. I don't want Omnitron to be playing stuff, so I'm going to put this out into the world. Put Primordial Seed from your hand or trash. Do I have any in my trash? I do. Uh, Vitalized Thorns, though. Real good. And shuffle that into the environment deck. Got the lowest HP. Uh, this does. Judgment of Anubis. Uh, we'll play the top card of the environment deck. Noxious Pods. Uh, play from the environment deck. Discard a number of cards. Draw as many cards discarded this way. Uh, we can discard Strangling Roots. We can discard Rapid Growth because of Kosh 3. It does not have... She just doesn't have the health. Skip that. Everything is taking one damage. What happens here? Each target takes, uh, what is this? Uh, destroy one environment card for a target with three or fewer HP. Oh, man. Alright, well, it doesn't matter then, so just choose one. Uh, choose for me. Oh, I can destroy an environment card. Meanwhile... I misread that. End of turn. Skip. Deal your one damage. Destroy this. This takes place first. Get out of here, Judgment! Uh, yeah, I do. Shamis. When he enters play, search the environment for a deck for the Broad of Anubis, put it into play, search the environment deck, shuffle it. Then the environment turns Shamis deals the non environment target with the second lowest HP to infernal damage. Hmm. Oh, discard the top card of the environment deck. Hey! Um. Sure, Wraith. Actually, end of turn. I want this one. Because now I can Lonesome Highway. You are not immune to a melee. I'm gonna play this. I'm gonna hit Anubis for two. But I can hit Omnitron for four. Feels good. We need to get rid of Anubis. Draw some cards. All right. What do I even have? Oh, hey. Repair Ley Line. So everyone heals one. Uh, yeah. Do I want you to use the power? Sure. That can't deal any, so yeah, I want to get rid of Anubis. So one person can use a power. Oh, hey. Um, absolute zero, heal up. Who do I want to use a power? Akash 3 has actually got a whole bunch. And... Let's get another healing pollen in there. And lifeline. Cosmic Immolation. Seems good. Uh, deal one target, one lightning damage. Sure. All all the little bits help. Let's play this. So I don't want to do five damage. No, we want to bonkify Shamise. 
could heal someone. Or just deal a little bit of damage. You know what? We'll, we'll just heal the team. Seems real good. Uh, reveal a top card. Never villain targets destroyed. Play oh, trash. Ugh. All right. One target, three cold damage. The shockwave dies. These are hard to set up, but if you do, they're really good. So we'll deal the cold. And we can get rid of Shamise. Uh, take the... Actually, give one to Lifeline. And give that to Wraith. Oh. That doesn't quite work. Oh well. Get. Hmm. Play the top three cards in the environment deck. When you play a non-target card this way, cost three deals yourself psychic damage and destroys an environment card. When you play a target this way, that target deals one target, three toxic damage. Odds are actually pretty good. Uh, three toxic damage. Alright, let's discard the top card of the environment deck. Destroy this. Ursh. Well, you're gonna hit yourself, sir. In an environment turn, reveal the top five cards of the environment deck, put all revealed trials into play, discard the remaining revealed cards. Oh yeah, no, you need to go. From hand to trash. Oh, one second. Or, yeah, I think I clicked the wrong button. One second. Uh, use power. From hand. Yes. Which uh, one do I want to shuffle into the deck? Do I want to shuffle any into the deck? There's not a whole lot. Are they all in here? They are all in here. Yeah. I mean, it's my odds are still really good. Uh, card is destroyed. It deals up to three targets, one toxic damage, and we'll hit. Matter healing pollen. Who needs a heal? Akash Thria. Skip that. I just discarded all the stuff. Stupid Ursha. Destroy all environment cards. Yeah, you deserve that. That then plays everything, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. I mean, look, we're gonna get... Oh, no. No, 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 no. I think we're dead. think we're actually just dead. Oh, nope. I misread. I, I, I read that it's two damage for each thing, uh, each what's it destroyed this way. Alright, we are very low though. And all of our, all of our equipment's gone. So, I... I'm going to put this out. And I'm going to hit this. Oh, well, he's immune. How is he? Oh, right. Use a power. Oh, 
Oh no, that took absolute zero out of the fight too. Oh, okay. Three cards from your trash. Three other targets, three infernal damage. Alright, actually, so I didn't realize he had a hero. Use a power. It's punching time! Let's harrow away all of this mess. Ugh, who, do, who even gets to draw? No, you don't. Uh, I'm gonna do it. She needs. She needs new equipment. I'll put this into play. It's not much, but hey, it's three damage. It gets rid of. Oh, that's projectile damage. So I don't need to worry about that. I am going to blow up the healing pollen, though. Choose for me. Just to get us somewhat back on our feet. Hey, a grappling hook. If he didn't have two of these things, that would be great. Uh, we're gonna get this out. We just need defenses at this point, just to get ourselves set up again. Alright. Shuffle either one or all cards in the environment trash. Uh, deal psychic damage if she does. Shuffle the environment trash in the environment deck. Play a top card in the environment deck. You may destroy an environment card. I need shuffle all cards from my discard pile into the environment deck. Bird an explosion. That's a primordial tree. Moment the land is probably not it. Ah! That is good, though. That is actually really good. Move one from... We need the healing. Well, actually, Strangling Roots is pretty solid, so... Uh, more Strangling Roots. You can't deal as much damage to me. Uh, choose for me. It's pretty good. Oh well. Actually, go back to play a card. Hmm. Choose for me. Let's hit this. This. M. Put that in the environment trash. Vitalize thorns. Choose for me. Oh, it's destroyed. It deals the three damage. Wait a minute. How does this work? You're trying to be dealt damage by an environment card. Okay, I was, I was about to say. Alright, then we'll just destroy the repair drone. Well, that's not that bad. It's frustrating, but it's not that bad. Wait, this was supposed to be end of turn. Oh, because all of it was destroyed. Oh, no. Well, that's... What? I don't like that at all. Yeah, 
Yeah, you all can deal one damage. I don't, I don't care. Choose for me. And then I'll take out the stupid drone. Um, doesn't help me at all. Doesn't help me at all. Oh, this place from the environment, right? Let's find out. No, it doesn't. Play a card. Alright, that is what I wanted to test. Oh wait, each hero regains 1 HP. We all draw a card, and then we play the top card of the environment deck. Noxious Pods. Discard any number of cards. Draw as many cards as you discard this way, plus one. Alright. One. Two. Three. Yeah. Uh, who gets to do a thing? Absolute zero. Hit him. Let's hit him for two. Um, not what we needed. Redirect that to the thing with the highest. That doesn't actually... Not the worst. Uh, do I kill Noxious Pods? No. Not yet. Um... This is dead. Alright, I do play this, because that stops some of the damage he can deal. Must does he deal to the lowest? Highest, okay. Can you play a non-target card this way? Oh, no, no, nope, not doing that. Which is the one that lets me shuffle stuff from my trash into the environment deck? Remember primordial seeds from your trash to the environment trash. Seems to be the one I need to do. If I can survive, uh, I'll just choose for me. If I can just have a Kosh 3 of survive, alright, that's fine. Yep, that's uh, just... Oh, that's just great. That's really unfortunate. Drop the hammer, destroy a number of your equipment cards. I would like to. Uh, shard strength. Two standard strength return, mainstay deals himself. Three damage dealt by mainstay by one. Hmm. Hit him for three. Destroy the Void Belter. Hit him for four more. Uh, no. Uh, 
Oh, this also would be real nice. Mm. Playline shift. Choose for me. What can I put into play? Calculated action. Deals himself one in front of them. How much else does he have left? He, he can't take that. Um... None of these are actually good. We'll just play the creepy mold. Kostria. What does Unleash Energy do again? <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, moving equipment trash. From a hero trash into play, one hero regains 2 HP. Kostria, heal up! Um, yeah, and I don't think we got this. Um, shuffle one card or all cards. Yes, do it. Shuffle. All cards in the environment trash. Play the top card of the environment deck. You are bad. And you are bad. And you are bad. Draw a card. Do I have any... Yeah, I don't care. Discard the top card of the environment deck. Oh. Let's see. Well, how does this work? Highest HP and the highest HP. So actually, let's go back to start of turn. Want to hit him? Want to hit these? Oh, no, no, no. Start a turn. Alright. Wanna hit her? Okay. I gotta hit this first. That deals. Just choose for me. Destroy an environment card. Yeah. Who are an Ongo? Oh, no. We gotta get rid of Anubis. And thus we die. Oof. What a rough. We were really hamstrung by Absolute Zero's in, uh, inflexibility. There's there's a reason that I don't like Freedom 6 Absolute Zero, because he is completely inflexible when it comes to dealing with, to, to dealing damage. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. I'm Polius, playing Sentence Multiverse. See you all next time.